This video was created by Vinylic Puma of Vinylic Puma Gaming. What's going on everybody? This is Vinylic Puma and today I have the fourth puzzle for the bass synthesizer um, on Fract OSC. So this will be the um, bass synthesizer puzzle solution number four. Um, now, if you can see where I am, I am basically in this main area here, and I'm going to show you how to find this thing. Um, now, if you go up through there, so if we go down here and we go up through there, that's going to take you to where the third puzzle solution is. And this one will take, I will now go to where part four is. So you're going to want to go up here. You're going to go through here. And if you look on your left, you're going to see another one of these things. Make sure to examine it and remember this for later. Now we're going to go ahead and go on through here. And this will take us to the first waypoint, which is right here. And here's the waypoint for this. Go in here. And of course, like always, if you want to return to the main hub area, you click on this. And clicking on these will allow you to return to various other puzzles in the level. So now what you're going to want to do, this is sort of weird in how you get in here. But I usually just do this. Just run up this thing. And drop down. Then kind of go to the side here. And you'll find a little area where you can enter. So you can kind of see there and go on in. Now this puzzle is really tricky um, and it took me a long time to figure this one out originally so if I do screw up a little bit here uh, just bear with me I will have the correct solution here. So what you're gonna wanna do go ahead and activate this. Now what you're gonna want to do activate that and our first goal of business is going to be to activate this. Now what you're going to want to do, open this up. So that's now permanently open and you can get over here. Now what you're going to want to do is you're actually going to take this off. And just to show you that this works, you can still traverse this area. So you don't actually need to have... Um, this thing activated here like you do in previous puzzles but anyway we'll go ahead and we'll continue here so what I usually do is I put this here this like this um, this like this I believe and I think I might modulate this slightly yeah it looks like it still works Pull this one down and then you're going to want to um, place this one like this this thing like this and now let me see here let me double check I have everything correct okay so these look right Now, where this gets tricky is you have to be really um, precise in how you calibrate these. So that one now works. And I think if you move this one back, that one will work. So that's the first part of this part one of this puzzle. God, that's really confusing. Anyway, this is fully accurate now. Um, as you can see, all the purple things are now lighting up. So that takes care of that. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go over here. And this is also sort of tricky. Go ahead and activate this. Move this here. Put that there. Then, let me see here if I've got this right. Yeah. What you can do here is you're going to want to modulate this slightly to where it activates. There you go. Now, let me figure out what you need to do. Alright, so go ahead, move this one up, and 
move this one over. I move this one like this. That will now activate this one. Now we just have to get this one activated. And this should be as simple as moving this back. So that completes this puzzle. Now, like I said, this one's pretty tricky because you have to balance all of these uh, gauges just right on both sides. Um, the important thing to remember is you don't need this thing active all the time. But now we'll go ahead and we'll go to the next part. So walk through here. Like always, these will materialize before you. This one's a little further away. And now what you're going to want to do is you're going to enter this pa pattern on the console. Um, there's probably other ones you can do, but this one will work. And now what you're going to want to do... is that'll complete puzzle four. And that's gonna pretty much wrap up the, um, the main puzzles for the base synthesizer. What I'll do in the next video is I'll go over the, um, the main, um, the final base synthesizer puzzle where we'll tune the giant base synth synthesizer. Ugh, can't talk today. But anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If this video helped you out, please be sure to rate, comment, and subscribe to my channel. It really helps me out. Otherwise, I'll see you guys later. Take care, guys, and have a good one.